I bet you all didn't know I had a job. Are you kidding? Excuse me, ma'am. Can I try to go that way? You literally was chasing me! If anybody has anything to say, you see me! Waiting for our boyfriend's hand! No, <laughs> <laughs> Bitch, I'm late to get my tooth tightened. <laughs> Sunglasses on. And I wanted to let her tighten it up a little bit, but she was like, it's glued to the wire that's in the back, so we don't have to do that. Like, if I do, then there's just gonna be a bunch of glue. She was like, it's fine, your gums are just healing, so they're. My gums are doing something, and my tooth is doing something, okay? I don't know. I suck at repeating information. Clutch. I don't know if you guys can see. Can you see? I have some things coming up soon and I would just hate for my tooth to fall out. So I just wanted to go in and make sure. I love going into that dentist office. They're so nice. They're like, hey girl, what's up? We all have like a trauma bond after my tooth situation. I don't know what today holds. Be prepared. I just uploaded a video to my YouTube channel, a very important video. Yeah, it's this one. It's very short. Talking about my relationship status. I have been having so much anxiety uploading that video because I get so many questions asking me like, where's your ex? Can we not? Can we not? But like, I understand at the same time. So I'm very happy that I just uploaded it. Kind of like taking a weight off my back. And I also asked the question in that video if you guys wanted me to start vlogging. This is my second day vlogging, so I'm already in it. It doesn't even matter what y'all say. Excuse me. Excuse, Excuse me? me? What? I'm kidding. I've got like some really great responses from you guys saying like, yes, absolutely start vlogging, girl. I just feel so much closer with you guys now that I'm vlogging. I'm gonna do my makeup a little bit so I don't look so... I'm actually gonna go to my job. I bet you all didn't know I had a job. I'll show you guys whenever I get there. I just got to my job. Literally the first job I've ever had in my life. Well, I mean, I worked with my granddad doing insurance from like age 17 to 20. One. You know, when you work with family, it's not really the same. This is the only job that I've had other than YouTube. I've been doing this thing called Amazon Flex for a while. I had no idea it even existed until Jesse told me, but when he's not working Spirit of Halloween, or is it Spirit Halloween? <laughs> when he's not working Spirit, he usually does this. I wanted to give it a try, and I actually really like doing it. You're your own boss. You go through Whole Foods, and you pick up groceries for people that have ordered online, and you deliver it to their houses. I gotta go, I gotta go pick up the groceries. Sorry, excuse me. Oh, yeah, he's fine. Yeah, he looks good. Are you kidding? Excuse me, ma'am. Can I, can I go that way, please? Did y'all hear me trying to get by that old ass lady? Like I love old people, but like old people at Whole Foods. Let me rephrase that. Karen's at Whole Foods. If you work at a grocery store, then you've probably encountered so many rich Carols and Karens. I love when people get flowers for deliveries because I'm like, what's the special occasion? I'm so nosy. Jesse, if you're watching this, I really want some flowers. I'm kidding, babe. You don't have to get me flowers, but it would be nice. So I have a total of three deliveries. I have a bunch of packages and I just delivered to my first house. And it looks like I'm getting really good houses, so that means really good tips. <laughs> Y'all, I forgot my pepper spray. Just had a crackhead. Chase me. Oh my god. I wish I caught that on camera. She literally was chasing me. I gotta get out of here. I gotta get out of this neighborhood. I was in a good neighborhood, but now I'm in a bad neighborhood. Oh my god, oh my god. A crackhead is in that vehicle. Legitimately in that vehicle yelled at me. I'm officially done with my Amazon block. I got Chipotle. <laughs> my stepdogger. So remember in yesterday's vlog how I said that I might go to a club by myself? I am considering going tomorrow to see Sivan at work, working with Iggy Azalea. I kinda wanna go, but I'm so tired now. I said I would be going by myself where Jesse works, long hours. He said that he would come with me. I always go by the saying, I'll sleep when I die. <laughs> Give me a news 
report, babe. We're here live on the scene at NYPD, about to get a two slice special for six bucks. <laughs> not a good angle. Really, do look not. naked. Show them the main attraction over here. Oh, I thought you were gonna show yourself. Oh, the cops came out. Nice. He's trying to ride their ATVs. Uh, this road's closed, babe. <laughs> Look at this dude. <laughs> Wait till you see the. F what the hell was that? I feel like I look like a smashed muffin. Give me, give me a how do you do? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Come on. Do it. He wore. Bruh. Can I ask why you wore that? <laughs> Those shoes. Oh, these sneakers look stupid, believe me, I tried. And uh, boots didn't do it either. I only said that, babe, because we're going to a club. Right. That was it. You look very handsome. I thought it was funny how I kind of look like a... Uh, stripper? Don't I look like a stripper? No! I'm gonna be frank and honest with you. We don't want to go. We don't want to be downtown. It's creepy. I can't believe I thought I was going to go by myself. I don't know where I got off thinking that that was okay because... Like, honestly, what the fuck? Plus, there's like a cover charge. It could possibly be $40 each. And I'm sorry, but would you guys pay $40 to go see Iggy Azalea? No, not to see. Oh, not even to perform. To watch her sit in a chair. <laughs> I didn't even know y'all were here. Well, I guess it's okay now since you're already here. <sighs> oh, boy. Well, good thing that you guys got me up because I need to get up anyway. <sighs> I love looking outside first thing in the morning. Yeah. That's a nice view. Hi, puppy. Do you like me? I hope you like me. I just want to be No, thank you. No, thank you. Guys, we have a busy, busy day in front of us. Great news, I got two auditions. So I have two self-tapes that I have to do today. One of them is due tomorrow. So I have plans tonight. Jesse has his first show. I've never seen him and his band play live. And I'm really, really excited for it. So that means I really gotta get going. Okay, can I please get a grande ice apple crisp macchiato? I got my coffee. Yes, thank you. And I got my burrito. No! Hell yeah, I have obtained the burrito. Let's get it. Yeah. Yeah. Burrito from Golden Pride. I got a carne avada burrito with eggs and hash brown. I still have trouble eating. <laughs> this burrito makes me feel like a true New Mexican. It might not look the best, but it's good. Okay, so first audition, I'm ready. It's the one that's due tomorrow. Ooh. It's for the role of a teenager. Hopefully, I look like a 17 year old. I don't know, what do you guys think? <laughs> So this audition is for a show on HBO Max. Ooh, wow. I know, I know, I know, I know. I'm freaking out too. Start doing the first one and then we're gonna move on to the second one. Spritz, spritz. Actually all over me. I'm getting ready to go to the venue for Jesse's show. This band is called Patema. I'll put everything in the description if you wanna look at them, check them out. We are at our first concert in the post-COVID era. Uh, we're over here, we just finished setting up our merch table. Let's take a look. Hi! Hey! <laughs> so here it is, we're about to turn on the ring light. Oh my god, so hot. We have our little uh, set list that we're gonna tape on the ground in front of us. We typed the first line of Memoria because Jaden keeps forgetting it. Say whatever you feel. Whatever you feel. There you go. A margarita and it was really good. Boy. Boy. My name is Michael Trambouille and I ain't gonna learn nothing happen in Thailand. Honey. You see, I'm a bodyguard. And if anybody has anything to say, you see me? <laughs>
ready right now. I'm gonna up shock, I'm so excited. Did you do? 